A lot of pregnant women have questions about edema, also known as swelling, and they want to know what's normal and what's not. During pregnancy, your body actually increases fluid volume and body fluids by about 50% to, ne to meet the needs of your growing baby. And all of this extra fluid has to go somewhere and sometimes it ends up in your tissues and makes you feel really swollen and puffy. It can be normal if your rings don't fit very well or if you feel like you have tree trunk legs at the end of the day when you've been on your feet all, all day, but it's normal swelling if you go to sleep, you wake up, it's kind of reset itself and then it all starts over the next day. Swelling can be made worse if you've been on your feet for a long time, if you've been out in the heat, if you have a high sodium diet, if you're consuming a lot of caffeine. All of these things have an effect on it. So to reduce normal swelling, put your feet up at the end of the day. Um, avoid being outside in the sun for long periods of time. Um, alternate between periods of standing and sitting. Wear supportive stockings that go either to your knees or above as recommended by your doctor to help keep circulation flowing through your legs. Um, go sit in a pool on those hot summer days and uh, um, lower the amount of sodium that you eat each day or salt. And it might sound counterintuitive, but actually it will help if you drink more water because sometimes if you're dehydrated, this is why it happens, it's more likely to happen when it's hot outside, um, your body retains fluid. And it, so if you drink water, then your body will start flushing it and fluids will shift to the appropriate place and not be stored in your tissues. There are some times when swelling can be concerning. Um, for a long time, swelling has been associated with preeclampsia. Your mom or your aunts or your grandma may have referred to it as um, toxemia. And basically what it is, is high blood pressure in pregnancy. Um, this is no longer a standard for diagnosis because a lot of pregnant women swell. But if you notice a sudden increase in swelling, especially if in your face, then it is, it's not a bad idea to call your doctor and get your blood pressure checked just to rule that out as a possible cause. Another type of swelling that can be concerning is swelling that happens just in one leg and not the other. So instead of just having like, you know, cankles at the end of the day, one leg is swollen and the other is not. And um, this can be associated with blood clots and it may also cause pain. So if you notice this, call your doctor and let them know. They'll perform an exam and decide if further investigation or treatment is necessary for it. If you have more questions for me in the future, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Intermountain Moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.